Would you trust someone of a different race to cut your hair? Yeah, sure. Why not? It's actually interesting you say that because a lot of black people like yourself, they sometimes only want black barbers. Ah, so, really? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know. I just uh, never encountered this. I don't know, it's interesting to hear that from a black perspective, like, like yourself, you know? Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, you, you are black, right? <laughs> I don't know. What, what do you mean, like, black? Uh, next question. Um, d uh, do you put oil in your hair? No. No, never. No? It seems a weird thing to put in your hair. No. Oil? Oil, yeah. What kind of oil? Olive oil, like, coconut oil. No. Nah. No. Nah. Why not? Why would you? Why? Why would you do that? Do you put oil in your hair? Yes, Straight every single up. day. Every day. Every day. Yes, I do put um, oil in my hair, like literally every day. You don't want that good glow, though. Sorry? You don't want that good glow, though. No, no, thank you. You don't want that good glow, though. Nah. Olive oil. Nah. No way. I don't really like feeling like oily. It just feels weird to me. Does it not get greasy? That's the point. We need it. <laughs> <laughs> we, we need the grease. Yeah. That's the thing. Why people don't want oily hair? Yeah, we need. We need <laughs> oily hair. You put oil on on your head. No, should I? Apparently that helps it grow. <laughs> Think out me in. If you didn't oil up your toes and your hair, what would happen? Yeah. You'd be dry. Dry as a crocus bag. Grey. If I'm seeing... I'm Grey? Seeing, yes. I'm seeing any form road. of dust. What does it do? It makes your hair oily. What would that do for me? Get gyal? You need to add that into your um, hair care. Would the, would, that is would actually... You need to be doing some of this, this, these foot treatments as well. Yeah, you should, man. Um, it's without your feet, where are you gonna get? Max, bro. <laughs> really like if you're walking around your arms like a dickhead, would you be insulted if someone laughed at your hairline? Uh, no. Nah, not really. Absolutely, not. I don't care. No, I'd be more than complimented if somebody thought I had one. Do I care about my hairline? Yeah. Me personally? Yeah. Uh, I know you're not about to fire. <laughs> I'm about to fire on there now. But look, I'm just growing my hair out right now. So I'm just being natural. No, I wasn't. I wasn't in your hairline, bro. I'm saying that like <laughs> hairlines in general. Is it something <laughs> trying to talk about no, my hairline, my bro? Ninety-five percent of black men care yeah. about their headline. If someone insulted your hairline, yeah. how would you take that? I've never had to even think about that. Still, I'm always keeping it fresh. <laughs> yeah. it doesn't really bother me. I don't think it looks bad on any other guy. So why why should I care if it looks bad on me? No, you know, I don't bro. think a hairline's that important. No, bro, bro. <laughs> I agree. I've not been observing that, bro. There's some hairlines like, bro, some guys need to be arrested. Everybody think about hairlines. No, in the white community, they don't. He told me that. Because I can just cover mine up. Yes, you do. You care about your no, hairline. Yes, you do. If somebody puts your hairline right here, whether you white, black, Puerto Rican, you're going to know and you're going to be, you know what I'm saying? I need to look fresh, which could happen every week. Every week? Every yeah. week, or, yeah, or every two weeks at max. Because I might wait two months before getting my hair cut again. <laughs> <laughs> Is that crazy? Two months? That's, that's two months what are you thinking of? <laughs> two months is very wild. How often do you get your hair cut? Uh, maybe once every six months. Once every three months, roughly. But when I'm just, you know, when it's too long. I just get a cut when I'm like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. I like cuts. <laughs> How do you like your steak cut? How do I like my steak cut? Mm. I actually haven't eaten steak in um, multiple years. Are you a vegan or poor? I'm usually not cool with how it looks after about 10 days. I need to stay looking fresh. I'm a musician. Mm. I perform. I can't go on stage looking dusty. For two months. <laughs> For two months. I know some, I know some white people, who, what they do, what they do, they'll, they'll shave their head and then they'll wait till it gets long, like down to their shoulders, <laughs> and, and then they'll shave it again. That's like six months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy. I don't even like really go to the barbers to cut my hair either. Like, I just, I let it grow really long. Um, and then if it gets too long or whatever, I get bored of it, I'll just shave it all off, basically. Maybe people are just a bit more uh, mindful about how they look, innit? You think black people are more mindful about how they look than white people? Uh, just, if you're, if, <laughs> look at your haircut every six months, you don't give a damn. I feel like for us, it's a want. We want to get our hair cut, whereas you guys get your hair cut when you, you need, need it. to. It's like <laughs> <It's going> to <laughs> the dentist. <laughs> basically. <laughs> I think some people, like, look good with a receded hairline, dare I say, or like, just, yeah. What do you think of that, my man? <laughs> the reason this series is so awkward is because I have to stand up for white people. Yeah. And that's not something you should ever do. You need to look fresh. We got, because I'm going to Nan's music shoot today. So I had to look fresh for it. So I just got a trim. Whenever I'm going somewhere, I need an appointment like as close to me doing something. Like I've got an event today at work. So. See, that's something that doesn't, that doesn't happen as much in, in the white community being like, oh, I need a haircut because I'm going somewhere this, this evening. But what if it's like a big occasion though? It could be, oh, I'll get a haircut the week before. 
Wait, 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 wait. So if you were going to your sister's wedding, you get a haircut the week before. Yeah, that would still look fine, but it's not going to oh. look different. It would, it's not going to look different. Mad, <laughs> <laughs> Say you had like a wedding coming up. Would you get it cut day off or would you maybe get it cut a few days before and sort of wait for it to grow out a bit? Yeah, probably a few days before. The thing is with my <laughs> hair. Sometimes I might even. Sometimes it might even look better the week after. What about your own wedding, though? Answer that question. For my own wedding. Your instinct to get your hair cut the day before. It wouldn't. It wouldn't be my instinct. So if you do it like a week before, two weeks, you'd be like, "That's karma." What's your hair type? I'm not curly. I have curly hair. No idea. Long ish. Short ish. Sparse. Caucasian. What is your hair type? I'm pretty sure I'm a strong 4C. 4A and B. Put it a 4B. Like a 4C, 4B. 4C, 3B. Oh, I have no idea what that is, no. Six. What's your hair type? Uh, Tory. The number's the curl, and then the letter, ah, damn. One is the curl, and one is like, if the hair's kind of like fine or thick. Which of these would you say you are? Oh Lord. Lord. <laughs> oh, is that Lord? Yeah. I was thought I thought you were saying oh Lord is in like oh Lord. <laughs> but it's actually a picture of Lord. She got famous when she was 16 for singing a song about being broke. I don't know. Yeah. She's like indie everyone hates me kind of vibe. She got famous for singing a song about being broke. Yeah. And she sang it proudly. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, black people definitely don't listen to her. <laughs> Do you ever go to a hair store? Um Hair store? What's a hair store? Don't think I've ever been to one. No. Do you go to uh, hair shops? I do. Yeah, but they tend to be owned by Asians, so... Okay, Does just it saying it like that. <laughs> Rah, boy! I didn't even ask! Are they owned by Asians? Yes. It'd be better if it'd be more <laughs> of our people doing our hair. Places like Pax and all that stuff. Yeah. That's, that's the main one that everyone goes to. What's it called? Pax. P-A-K-S. Yeah. You've never seen Pax? Oh, I don't... It's, it's like that's not over. short for something racist, is it? No, no, <laughs> no, that's the, the name, name of the shop. It's the name of the shop. <laughs> no, 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 well, no, because... That's, 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 that's a good point. That's a very good point. You're assuming that... Yeah. <laughs> but it's called Pax. And it's got the green, it's a green sign and everything. Are they always owned by um, Asian dudes? Sorry, Asian, Asians in general. Sorry, I don't... What, yes. Sorry, are your... Do you find hair shops are owned by... Is this, a, is this like a... Awkward question. Is this a bad question? Yeah, I think that's a bit of a bad question if you're putting that on YouTube, quite honestly. You think the bad question yeah. is? Yeah. But don't talk about Asians, man. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think of Asians? Great. What's your favourite type of Asian? Oh, a really guy in here? <laughs> Would you let someone of a different race do your hair? Absolutely. Sure, yeah. Absolutely. You wouldn't mind if it was just someone of a different, someone Mongolian or? No, I think a lot of people have done my hair have been of a different race. Would you trust a different race to cut your hair? Ooh. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. 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 Uh. No. This is hurting my arm, by the way. <laughs> I don't think I could because, like I said, everyone's hair texture is different, and they don't know how to cut someone that has my texture of hair. As long as I, I can see your work, right, and I can see that you've done similar hairstyles to mine. See, like how you made us be able to walk into any shop yeah. and get a haircut because it says barbers. Yeah. And you just automatically think, yeah, they must be good. Yeah, I'll look at the font. Yeah, you, yeah, you'll probably look at the font. Oh, that's a nice font. Yeah. <laughs> Would you trust someone of a different race to cut your hair? Yeah, sure, why not? It's actually interesting you say that because a lot of black people like yourself, they sometimes only want black barbers. Ah, so, really? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, know. I just uh, never encountered this. Yeah, nah. I don't know. I guess I don't know. It's interesting to hear that from a black perspective, like like yourself, you know. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Um. Well, you, you are black, right? <laughs> I don't know. What, what do you mean, like, black? So say you saw me, I and you need a haircut, and I was like, oh, okay, I, I, can, I, can, I can sort you out, I can fix you up. I'll look at your trip first. But the looks of you, I'm like, nah, you ain't touching my head, mate. <laughs> <laughs> really and truly, from my area, South London, there's a place called Slick Cuts, where it's a guy called Lively, who's an Asian brother, but obviously he's been there for ages, so you've always trusted him, so he's not necessarily a black don, but you know what? A man's been taught from, from experience, you know, I was there, so you know, I, I, think, I, think I, would, I think I would go to a don. If I looked at him, I'd be like, yeah, my man's definitely cut another bro's hair before. <laughs> Do you know what it is? I look at, I, I have to look at his swag and be like, I'd be like, <laughs> I don't know, bro, I don't know, the swag, I don't know, I don't know. Do you think he has swag? 
Um, mm, sorry, bro. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I I don't know you, but um, bro, you quite mix up with your colors them today. Well, if I had like an Instagram page up. And you could see I was slaying wig installs and all of this stuff. Plenty of people who look like me who can do wigs yeah, as well. Exactly. Nah. But wait, I might have a, my. Have you seen my? Yeah. You guys just gotta have everything. In the <laughs> 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 Next question. <laughs> there it is.